Hello, my darlings. Happy Wednesday to everybody. It's Wednesday, isn't it? It is Wednesday. I've had a discussion with myself and I've decided that it's Wednesday. Blue is with us. Hello, Blue. Welcome to Let's Build. Well. And welcome. <laughs> what was that? What was what did I just do then? Did I even just press the right button to do that? I've no idea. I probably didn't. I probably didn't even do a voice effect on that one. Anyway, hello. Welcome to part one of Brindleton Park Church. We are doing a park build. We are starting a park build, but I've decided on doing a church. I've decided I said I was going to, so I think the park would be the perfect place to have a church in. And that is what we're gonna do. We're going to try and make it look like the church is kind of intermingled with the park itself rather than having a separate sort of like church and then a park. I just want it to look like a church grounds, like in a Cornish church, very inspired by this one here that I'm going to pop up right in front of my face, right here, darlings. Right, this one here. It, this is St. Columbus Church in St. Colum Major or Minor? Major or Minor? near Nuki in Cornwall. And I just thought this church here would be perfect for us to build in Brindleton Bay. So that's what we're going to do. Now, I really want this place to be a wedding venue as well. I'm sure you can still get married in parks. I don't do gameplay. I'm sure you can, can't you? You guys are going to have to let me know in the comments below. I was going to make this into a community space and I was like, nope, we're still going to do that. We're going to do a community space. Um, and then I was like, oh, maybe I should make it into a wedding venue instead. And then I was like, no, because that pack doesn't even work, does it? To be honest with you. So what's the point? What is the fucking point? Still very, very annoyed about that pack, I am. But that's what we're going to do today. And as always with part ones, we don't really tend to get much done. We just get the bare bones of the structure down. Um, so yeah, that's what we're going to do. And if you see me keep looking over onto my other screen i'm going by kind of reference images to that particular church um and yeah look at him with his little face rested on the oh oh i do love him i do love him so um but yeah nothing else to say let's get into game and let's start building this church right then my little pasty flaps here we are my sweethearts we're here this is where we're going to be building the church today this is when brindleton church it's going to be built um do you know how annoying are these lots like i'm like why is what's this let me try and get rid of the terrain paint here oh okay let me try and go in here and get the erase tool out on it no don't want to do that either what's that about what is this was that always like that that's annoying that is look at that same here what is that what what's with all these little patchy bits of sand maybe it's because it's near the beach and they but it's just it just looks weird i don't know why they've done that anyway hello here we are pulled out a few little cheeky cheeky bits uh let's get the lighting up a bit brighter at the minute uh, i'm gonna go for this brick here which is from jungle adventure i think that would really suit it uh i've pulled out these windows i'm not really a fan of these windows i don't like them um in all the swatches as well like, i was really excited to see some stained glass windows and i just i ugh. I just, I don't know what it is about them. Is anybody else like that with these windows? I like the shape of them and stuff. And I love this like detail and stuff here. But I just, I just don't like them. And I don't know why. So we're going to try and use them somehow, maybe. Um, You know how much I changed my mind. So that might change in itself. I've brought out some perimeter stuff. Some fences from live edits. Some walls. um, Like a church goings on board which is from i don't know where you're from actually outdoor retreat i did have the suspicions it was from there but and it, and it is it is it's absolutely from there so here we are lovely let's get going let's get going we've got a lot to do this is going to be quite a big build so we're going to crack on um tits out tits in a bra let's go let's go we're going to start with the turret um i think i'm going to go up maybe three stories maybe four uh, i don't quite know yet that is quite tall actually maybe if i did a fourth story but in a shorter height are you on short height because i haven't yet oh oh that's very dramatic isn't it very dramatic indeed i might do that we'll leave it like that for the minute uh and then thoughts were going up with these stone blocks i love that these all fit together lovely like you can put this into this one and then the stones get smaller at the top then look and then you can go up to this one here 
and it, and it just becomes a tiny little moment that I'm absolutely for and I'm about. You get this like, love. what did I say then? <laughs> I'm absolutely for and about, I meant to say, and I just went, blah, blah, blah. Um, yeah, yeah, maybe something like that. There we go, we're done. There's the church. Thank you for coming. Lovely. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for coming. That was, it was a lovely, lovely build, this one. <laughs> right, so now this kind of comes out here again i'm looking at that reference image it kind of goes to about i'm gonna go to about maybe there that might be a bit big actually i think i'm gonna do a three there no i'm not i'm gonna do a four i'm gonna do a four and then i'm gonna come out a four here oh i'm gonna come out even more than that though i'm gonna come out to about there with that one lock that one in like that my loves um and then bring that one i might do a three there or i might not i might not um in fact, if I do a four there, and then I'll copy this shape onto the other side as well. Now, I am going to be connecting in another building onto this as well, I think. Uh, this is kind of in the cross shape, you know. Um, to all of you religious um, lovelies out there, you know, whatever the cross means. Um, <laughs> and I don't mean that by, by passe, but I'm not religious, so it doesn't appeal to me in the slightest. Um... Am I going to be flopping you out? I am. I'm going to be whiffling you all the way down, darling. Right down to there. Right down to there. And right down to there. Lovely. Yeah. I think so. There is another, like, bit of building coming out here with a, a roof on it. But I'm unsure if I'm going to do that yet. Because it's kind of, like, weirdly around about... It's like at a five-wide one. About there. If I bring these out a little bit more. If I do these one two like that and then i bring this one out just two that should suffice love that word suffice we've kind of got rid of that cross shape now which i'm not too bothered about um and i'm gonna flop this one to here like a saw i'm not doing any terrain oh god i'm not doing any terrain manipulation or anything on this lot to be honest with you i'm gonna keep it all very flat very flat yeah yeah, something like that. So this one's kind of got a bit more of a Cassie, Cassily vibe on this edge here. Whereas the um, this bit here is a little bit more where well, it looks like a church. You know? And what's with the whispery, whispery tones that keep coming out of my mouth lately? I've no idea. It's my tooth. It's my chipped tooth that makes the noises. <laughs> uh, I don't know if I'm going to go up another height. I don't know whether to just put in... Like, oh, that's just going to be a single, <laughs> single. No, Aiden, absolutely not. That is not going to do. Um, hmm. I'm thinking with that roof line, though, it might be a bit difficult to replicate what is there without it looking weird against how tall this is. So maybe I will get rid of that top bit. That would be better. Yeah, I can feel the balance. I can feel it and I'm for it. Absolutely am. Right. I'm going to start doing the roof line now. So... This one, there's kind of like, mm, there's kind of like three separate bits on the back of the build here. Weirdly. Uh, I've got another view of the church itself, but there's like three different like bits here. But I don't know if I want to do that or not. I think I just want to keep it as it is like this. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'm going to. I am going to shuffle this along. This is in the wrong spot for me. I think I want to go a little bit more tight over this way and have this whole front area. So I might do a little bit of landscape, like land mani terrain manipulation in the front, but I'm unsure as of yet. Um, I just need a little ponder and I need a little play. And um, just with a roof line, just to sort of see if I come up with something that I like um, before we get set on it and move on to the next bit. Give me one sec. Okay, okay, I've decided on something. Um, and it looks fine with the roof as well. It does look fine. But what I had to do was widen everything. Um, and, oh, and just pull every... Oh, excuse you. Can you please work for me? Thank you. And this one here, um, I just made it a little bit longer. Same with this as well. I pulled this out one here. Then I also went into here and did those. Just widening the church down a bit. Just because we're going to do a single story church... Um, I also made this a little bit longer here. I think it was to there. And I also rung the width. Bought the width. To around about that. Uh, uh, who put who put that there? Me when I was like fart-assing around then. Um, oh, no, wrong one. 
I've also put the brick on it as well, just to sort of like get a feel for the vibe of it. But I think that is going to be a lovely church shape. Now, I do have to change something else as well, but we'll do that now. So let's flop in a little roof moment, my loves. Let's flop in a little roof moment and bring it to a roundabout, darlings. Around all the way to the bottom there. And I think I'm going to maybe just exaggerate the roof a little bit like that. Yes. Yes, that's nice. Now what I'm going to do is bring this side out and also this side here. Because what I want to do there is have that kind of castle sort of turret wall. I don't know what it's called. Um, castle wall. I'm just going to say castle wall uh, on that part there. Uh, and then put the root, another roof on this part here. Just like that. Just leave it like that, to be honest. Stunning. <laughs> bring this all the way down to like there. And then whiff all these shapes in either side. And the same over here as well. Um, not going to be using that uh, roof texture either. We're going to be choosing some different tiles for there. Yeah. Yeah, something like that. Something like that. And then what I'm going to do is go in with some half wall moments. Uh, I don't know what sort of size really. Let's start with you. You're, that's going to be weird if I start there. I don't know why, but it is. So I'm going to be starting here. And then I can... Oh, that's just going to be weird as well. I'm going to do you to you. Get rid of you. Have a little small moment in there. Mm. Oh, this is... <laughs> I'm trying to, like, have it balanced without, like, these bigger pieces being... And I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying, to be honest. I never do. I just wing it and hope for the best. That's my life. That is... That is my life story. I just wing it and hope for the best. Oh, actually, that doesn't look too bad. That doesn't look too bad. We're going to crack on with what we had going on then, because it's all going to be fine at the end of the day, isn't it? And at the end of the day, it's just a Sims build, you know? Nothing has to be perfect, loves. And let that go as a mantra for you guys today. If you are struggling with a little bit of build, if you are struggling with anything in life at the minute, life is pretty fucking weird at the minute. Um... After all of the horrible things I was reading in the news yesterday, I won't go into anything. Um, yeah, but pff, my, pff, I don't know what to say, you know? I really don't. But just know, I'm here for you. I'm here for absolutely every single one of you. Yeah, let's do a little small moment on the top. That looks nice. That looks nice. That looks nice. That looks stunning, that bit there especially. Um, yeah. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, that, I'm happy with that. Oh, did you hear me tell click? Yes, we can hear you. For goodness sake. Honestly. Honest to Betsy. <laughs> right, and I think actually I'm going to do it around here as well. I am going to do it around here because what I could do... Could I copy that over? No, <laughs> I can't. <laughs> I can't copy that over, Aiden, because it would not be equal. I was hoping to copy it over onto this side, but it won't work out that way. So I'm just going to do it like that, darlings. I like that. I like that. I hope I'm going to do this anyway. Let me see what it looks like when it's done. Yeah. Yeah, I am. I could tell straight away then I was for it, you know? So let's do it the same over here. Let's see if we can get some better lighting back here, please. There we go. Stunning. Lovely, jubbly. Um, thank you to you guys as well that came to the stream yesterday. That weird game. That weird game I played. It's called The Good Life. I literally thought it was... um kind of released in like 2013 or something. I was like, you can tell this is an old game. And everyone was like, Aiden, it came out this year. <laughs> I was like, oh, yeah. Um, it, was a bit, it was a bit, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if I'll, like, I'll continue on with that game at all. If you guys are wondering what it is, it's like a story of this like reporter who goes to investigate uh, an English town in which is supposed to be the happiest town in the world. And everyone changes into cats and dogs. I was like, oh my God, made up. Um, thought that was going to be really... And I just didn't like it. And I think it was the main reason. Um, because I hated the main character. Is anybody else like that? They can enjoy a game if they really dislike the main character. And the main character that I was playing was just an absolute twat. To be honest with you. Um, and yeah, the end. Thank you. <laughs> I bet you loved listening to that then. <laughs> <laughs> you're welcome you are really really welcome you very much are um okay okay i'm happy with that i think the tiles in question are going to be the tiles that we've used 
in a lot of the places around and, and that i used to death anyway and that's this these slate tiles they always work they never let me down um and i'm for it absolutely for it there we go oh i'm into that yeah yeah that's doing it for me that absolutely doing it for me doing it for me that now i think the hardest thing is going to decide on what to do with the top of this turret uh i think what i'm going to do is have a little look in i didn't find anything because i didn't really look for anything but i'm going to have a little look to see if i can find anything that would just act as a really nice um church kind of spire um with the kind of four points um let me have a little gander for it. okay what we're gonna do hear me out loves hear me out i'm gonna put these on top of each other like this and i think i'm gonna whiffle this in the middle here um oh yes i think something like that i'm wondering i'm just wondering if if i put this in a like oh that's not on the bloody grid aiden for goodness sake get down here get on the grid you silly bum right there we are lovely like this and then if i go in and make this a kind of a room can i now just copy this as a oh stunning <laughs> played the game for eight years and that then i'm like oh my god new features <laughs> <laughs> what was that laugh no idea what that laugh was but i'm gonna go with it loves um and we're gonna do the same here copy these all the way around hold down shift and just flop them into place like that loves right we got that. We got, we got that going on. That looks good to me at the minute, but I'm going to do a little castle wall moment. What is a castle wall? I'll tell you what it is, loves. This. <laughs> Absolutely this. Uh, and I think I'm going to keep those half walls wrapped around them. I didn't, I wasn't going to do that, but it kind of, kind of adds to the sol solidity of it. <laughs> oh, you would not think that English was my first language sometimes, would you? <laughs> I end up making things up myself, love. So do end up making up myself. Um, yeah, yeah, I'm kind of happy with that actually. I'm kind of happy with how that looks. I might even just change that to a tall wall. Oh yeah, that's a bit more drama, isn't it? Yeah, we'll go for a bit more drama there. Yes, yeah, that scaling's a lot better. I'm into that. Yeah. Okay. Well, there we go. We're all finished for today. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> joking just being silly just being absolutely silly with you today being silly right moving on so i think maybe uh, i just want some yeah just some like uh, maybe some slate actually would work yeah it would oh look at that I haven't even I haven't even done the inside there loves oh how dare i yeah that's kind of cute that's kind of cute now this one's got a clock here. So I might do a clock here and put a window up above it. The only problem with that is all of the arch windows, they just don't look like church windows or at least church windows in the UK that I'm used to, you know? Um, all of the, yeah, they just don't look good. So let me just try and find the best of the bad bunch and see what we can do with that, to be honest. The only one that I could find that kind of looks okay. I've tried a few things. I've tried doorways. Um, it's this one here and it fits in colour-wise perfectly. Uh, so I think I'm going to use this. Use this. <laughs> this is the bell tower anyway. We're not going to put anything in here apart from a big juicy bell end. That's what we're going to put in there, darlings. Um, Yeah. Yeah, I think that's cute. Wrong colour of the clock though, I think. I think the clock might be a bit of a wrong colour. I think I want to go a little bit more... Oh, that was quite nice, actually, that one. Uh, let's just have a little goosey-goosey go. Oh, that one's nice as well. Like that one. Yeah, that one there. What was the other one I liked? That one. No, not that one. That one. Yes, that's the ticket right there. Oh, I'm for that. Yes, absolutely for that. Now, they've got some church windows here. And I'm wondering whether these are going to suffice. I really wanted to use these. I really did. But I'm just... Ugh, it's just the black frame and everything on it. I don't like it. And I did have an idea of doing this. Look, this is what I was trialing. Trialing and testing and just to make it look a little bit more less. Oh, shit, to be honest. I can't think of any for any other word. <laughs> oh, I didn't press shit. <laughs> um, this here. And then whiffling this up. 
trying not to use the tool mod as best as I can because I can't be asked with it, to be honest. Sorry, <laughs> I can't. Especially after playing with Planet Zoo so much lately. I'm just like, I can't. I had to do all this. Right, maybe something like that. I don't know what I'm feeling about it, loves. What do you... Ugh. Ugh. No, that's the only colour that will work on this church, is that one. Ah, I don't like it. I just don't think it looks good, to be honest. <sighs> Back to the thinking book. Is that the is that the way to say that? No idea. Just need to have a think, to be honest. Okay, I've done a thing. And I meant to say, I realised, I meant to say back to the drawing board and I said back to the thinking book. Not back to the thinking book, Aiden. For goodness sake. Right, what, what I did, what I did is use this window here, flopped this on the inside and I sized, sized it down. I sized it down to a 0 0.95. Oh, 0 0.95. And um, I think that might su suffice. They do get a little bit of glitch on that other one. Ah, oh, I know why. I know why. It's because I did a 0 0.99 there. Um, So let's do 0. Point, no, not 0 0.9, Aiden. 0 0.95. Stunning. Get out of that one. That just adds a little bit more detail on the windows. Yeah. I'm not massively happy with them, but that's the best is what we've got. That is literally the best of what we've got in the game. Um, it really, really is. I've tried so many. I could probably... I don't want to put a black one up there. It needs to be a little bit less. Oh, yeah, maybe a little stained glass number up there. That could be cute. Uh, and around this side, I think I'm just going to use the church windows that I used to death. Um, and it's going to be those medium height these ones here and I think I'll just go for a nice brown on that side like that uh what does the gray actually look like I think it's too light I think the gray is a little bit too light ah uh, do you know what that's not too bad actually I wish this one came in a better color I really do but it is Realm of Magic and they loved their warm tones with that pack uh even though I really liked Realm of Magic I really did I thought it was a great pack that one um, I'm thinking about bringing this out one more. I know I need to go and do that window a little bit more, but I think... Um, not that window, the wall again, but I think I'm going to bring that out one more. So I could maybe put an archway there. And have a door on the interior. Like here. You know? Yeah, let's try that. Let's try that. So archway, I think we're going to go for those... Fail safe. Oh, please match in the colour tone. That's not too bad. It's a little bit light, but let me see that. Yeah, I think so. I think that might be the ticket. Uh, I'm going to go in with the brick in there as well. And I'm going to bish bash boosh out that too. Yeah, I think that might work. I think that might, might work. I don't really like that. <laughs> I keep looking at that stained glass window and I'm like, no, you're not the vibe. Go away. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Now I'm going to copy this over to these sides here as well. So I'm going to do a clock on each face. You can see the time from wherever you are in Brindleton Bay. It's the only way. And it has got them on each side of this um, um church turret as well. So I'm into it. Now it has got an archway going through here. And I kind of like that idea. But I would love to have used that one really. But maybe we could just use the short... Oh, the only problem with that is the swatches. And I mean the short arch, this one here. Because there's not very many swatches with this one. <sighs> Once again. Struggling with swatches, loves. And having a big, like, walk through here. I mean, I kind of like that. I do. I do actually like that. I am going to do what I did with the entrance and bish bash boosh out that. And flopping this on the interior here as well. Now I will do a little bit of work on um, this church off of camera too. Just to get more details and stuff in. But it's kind of like getting there. A little bit. I'm still not happy. I'm not happy with it. But I think 
the more I progress, the more it will get better. You know, it's like life loves. It's like it's like a life lesson here today with me. It really is. It's like life. The more you go through it, hopefully it will get better for you. Right. Okay. 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 Right. I want to get some detail up on this bit here. Now I don't want to go and use the um the roof pieces that we've got already in the game. I probably want to use something along the lines of that, to be honest. That's really nice. I'm just wondering if it will go up there. Of course it won't. Um, so I'm gonna have to lift it all the way. Where are you? You're gonna creep out somewhere weird. There we are. There we are. I want you in the middle, my love. And I think I'm gonna keep that little bit of detail that's on there as well all the way along let's have a look at that yes i think so yeah i do i do think so i think i'm gonna do that i do i think i'm gonna i think i am i'm gonna do it and i'll flop this all the way along so give me a second i'll pop this all the way along and i'll also fix this wall bit here uh, and i might even come out one more here as well just so it's nice and symmetrical on each side there we go equal on both sides and that's on the top there as well what i also changed was that arch I forgot about this one here, which is um, from the Wedding Stories pack, but it's on a tall height. So what I did is just put it on these walls here. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then I slipped it down with the tool mod. Um, I just think that works a little bit better on this build. So that's what we're going to do. That is what we're going to do. To finish off today, I'm just going to work on the perimeter a little bit at the front here. So we're going to start laying down where I want uh, the kind of fence to be i'm gonna bring it to around about there i think now let's come down to here so we can see the grid because i do want that to be perfectly in the middle of that doorway and there we are oh there we are indeed um i'm gonna come you're gonna go to there and i've sized down the gate i've sized the gate down and i think i'm just gonna slip the gate in the actual um wall itself so it might look a little bit weird but i just think we need a little gate moment there so that's what we're doing and we're using this wall here which is from cats and dogs shocking but it is it's absolutely from there uh i'm gonna plop you to around about here my love and hopefully i will be balanced on this side oh go on slip it oh you beautiful beautiful thing yes and the same with this here as well around to this way i'm gonna flop you right into there my love i'm not gonna do the whole perimeter um, I'm just going to do this little front bit here so it kind of envelopes it in quite nicely. And then this like church board can be at the front of the church somewhere. I'm thinking maybe over on this side actually near the lamp. So I'll flop you to about there. Beautiful. Uh, where are those? Oh, there they are. I was like, where are those little bricky bits? These bits here. I can't see where it ends to be honest. So I'm just going to flop you to there. Uh, is it there? Yep, yeah, one there. And then I'm going to bring that one quite tight in like that. Oh, yes. That kind of shuts off that whole area there then. Yes, for it. Um, there's another one there, my love. Not muted there. One there. And then I'll put one on the end. And I will do all of this around here at another point. Uh, but the same with these as well. Same with these. I'm going to be flopping you about, my darlings. Uh, hopefully I can fit this in quite perfectly, but I've got a funny feeling being The Sims is not going to allow it. Oh, that's not too bad. I would have preferred if it was like that, though. But let's try and make that happen. <laughs> let's try and make that happen. It might be a bit off on this side, but that is okay. We're going to do it like that. Yes, that's better. I'm going to do the same around here as well. So, oh, you're in the right position. Beautiful. Around to here, my darling. All the way to here. And the same to you. And the same to you, you know? Where was that separate pole? Was it this one? Yes. Um, oh, let's put you back and then I drop you. Beautiful. And we'll finish off that area there as well. You know, it's it's kind of getting there. I'm still not happy with those windows. But, <laughs> you know, you've got to make do sometimes with The Sims. You really do. And I might even try with the tool mod to get these pushed into the wall a little bit. I think I'm going to give that a go. I think I'm going to give that a go and see how that helps as well. But I think we're, we're done for today anyway. As I said, we never really do a lot on the first kind of build. Um, it's looking very bare at the minute, bless her. 
really is. But I'll be back again with this tomorrow. Be back again with this tomorrow. If you guys have got any ideas for the windows, then let me know. But I've tried all of them. All of the ones that I know would kind of like look like a church window. Um, and they just don't. They just literally don't. Um, which is very sad. Very, very sad indeed. Very sad day for all of us. But uh, I'm going to leave you here. I'll leave you here. Thank you so much for watching today. As I said, I'll be back with this tomorrow. And we'll continue on with it. But at the minute, I'm not that happy with it. But I will work on this a little bit off of camera. So it might look completely different by tomorrow, by the time we come back. Um, so be on the looks out for it. Uh, but yeah, thank you so much for watching, my darlings. And I'll see you all tomorrow. Goodbye.